Picture this. You're basking in the sun's warm embrace, enjoying a leisurely picnic in the park when suddenly an unwelcome guest arrives, its buzzing serenade shattering the tranquility. And suddenly a tiny needle-nosed assassin, its proboscis poised like a microscopic rapier, descends upon your unsuspecting skin. This miniature menace, the mosquito, is about to embark on an illicit culinary adventure, extracting a blood meal from your unsuspecting flesh. But this is no ordinary feast. It's a microscopic battlefield where your body's defenses engage in a battle of epic proportions. The mosquito's stealthy approach, a chemical camouflage. The mosquito's first act of subterfuge is to land on your skin without alerting your sensory defenses. It achieves this stealthy maneuver by releasing a cocktail of chemicals that temporarily disable your pain receptors. As you're blissfully unaware of its presence, the mosquito's proboscis, a bundle of six hair-like tubes, pierces your skin, seeking out a blood vessel. The proboscis in action, a microscopic siphon. Once the mosquito's proboscis penetrates your skin, it enters a vascular labyrinth, a network of tiny blood vessels. The mosquito's sophisticated proboscis acts like a microscopic siphon drawing blood from the chosen vessel. To prevent blood clotting and ensure a smooth flow of its meal, the mosquito injects a concoction of saliva into your bloodstream. Your body's defense mechanisms a rapid response. Your body, however, is not one to take this intrusion lightly. It immediately launches a counterattack, deploying its immune system to neutralize the mosquito's saliva and eliminate the intruder. His stamina, a key player in the immune response, is summoned to the scene. This chemical induces inflammation, causing the area around the bite to swell and become red. The itch factor, a misguided defense mechanism. The itch you experience is a result of your body's misguided attempt to eliminate the mosquito. Histamine stimulates nerve endings in the skin, sending signals to your brain that interpret as an itch. This sensation, while annoying, is actually a protective measure, urging you to scratch the bite and potentially remove the mosquito or its saliva. The aftermath, a fading mark. The swelling and redness around the bite typically peak within 24 to 48 hours and gradually subside. In some cases, the bite may develop into a papule, a raised, solid bump. This is due to an accumulation of white blood cells, which are part of your body's immune response. The papule usually disappears within a week or two. Prevention. Shielding yourself from mosquitoes. While mosquito bites are generally harmless, they can be a nuisance and even transmit diseases in some cases. To reduce your risk of mosquito bites, consider using insect repellent, wearing long sleeves and pants in areas with high mosquito populations, and eliminating standing water around your home, as this is a breeding ground for mosquitoes. The mosquito bite, a seemingly insignificant event, is a fascinating interplay between an opportunistic insect and your body's complex defense mechanisms. As you go about your day, be mindful of these tiny aerial predators, for they may be plotting a microscopic culinary adventure on your unsuspecting skin. But remember, your body is well equipped to handle these miniature intruders, and the itch you experience is just a temporary inconvenience in the grand scheme of things. So the next time you feel that familiar itch, take a moment to appreciate the intricate dance between your body's defenses and the mosquito's stealthy snacking strategy. Until next time, stay curious, keep challenging the status quo, and don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and turn on that notification bell. This is your host signing off. See you in our next value-packed videos. Until then, adios and take care.